In the previous video, we explored a pattern for factoring trinomials of the form ax squared plus bx plus c. We found that if the trinomial can be written in the form mnx squared plus mq plus np all times x plus pq, it can be factored to mx plus p times nx plus q. We use this pattern to show that if we can determine two integers that add to give b and multiply to give ac, the trinomial can be factored. Let's look at an example that uses numbers. We'll factor 2x squared plus 11x plus 12. The a value is 2, the b value is 11, and the c value is 12. a times c is 24, so we need to determine two integers that add to 11 and multiply to give 24. Again, we can use a table to determine these integers. Let's pick integers that we know will multiply to give 24. 1 times 24 is 24, but 1 times 24 is 25. This isn't a match. Let's try 2 and 12. They multiply to give 24, but add to give 14. This isn't a match either. How about 3 and 8? They multiply to give 24, and they add to give 11. These two integers work. Using a table to determine the integers isn't necessary, but it illustrates the thought process used for determining appropriate integers. As you get more comfortable with the process, you may choose to do some or all of this work mentally. The 3 and 8 represent the mq and np values of our original pattern. This tells us to split our b value into 3 and 8. So we'll rewrite this b value of 11 as the sum of 3 and 8. Now we can distribute the x across the brackets. Although the x is written on the right side of the brackets, this is the same operation as the more familiar looking one with the x on the left of the brackets. Our expression is now 2x squared plus 3x plus 8x plus 12. We're going to look at this expression as two pieces and factor each piece separately. The first two terms have a common factor of x. These terms can be factored as x times 2x plus 3. The third and fourth terms have a common factor of 4 and can be factored as 4 times 2x plus 3. Now the same factor shows up in both terms of the expression. As long as the decomposition process is done correctly, this will happen every time. The 2x plus 3 can be removed as a common factor. So 2x squared plus 11x plus 12 can be factored as 2x plus 3 times x plus 4. 